Hey viewers, welcome to another game of Casual Pro Gamer. Today we're doing Isolated Whirlwind, which is a pretty simple daily challenge of Bloons Tower Defense 5. And we are going to start off with, um, as you can see, a 3 and 1 boomerang monkey and an ice tower at, I believe, 2 and 1. It's starting off at 1 and 1 and then becomes 2 and 1. Not a big deal, um, we're going to go straight into uh, Banana Farm. You can of course uh, do this in several different ways, but I'm going for the 1 and 0 Banana Farm first, to then add on some more towers and then go for 2 and 0 eventually. But it will take a while, because, um, well, that's a really, or not really expensive, but it's a relatively expensive tower. So I'm going to add on just some add additional uh, crap, because I have to deal with this Camo Blooms for example. And I want to make sure that I get as many of these uh, things as possible before, well, kind of wanting to spend my money elsewhere. Oh, I'm going for two one and one towers apparently. It's about an equal amount of money. It's, um, it's all about when you place them and blah, blah, blah. But yeah, normally it's a little more economically viable to, uh, to go for two one and ones instead of one, two and zero. But I th in this case, it would have been better to do the two and zero first and then build the second one. But anyhow, um, yeah, just continuing on. Oh, by the way, uh, keep in mind that I did use the Boomerang Dojo for this one. Uh, not because you actually have to, because I don't think you have to. It just makes it a whole lot easier. Because, um, well, the Boomerangs will then fly two rounds, uh, well, or, well, an additional round if the maximum pop is not reached, which is especially handy in the early part of the game. But also, it, it makes everything a little more cheap. Uh, so a little cheaper, that is. And when everything is a little cheaper, everything is a little easier. So um, yeah, <laughs> there's that. Um, yeah, two fully upgraded uh, ninja monkeys here. A third one is underway, but um, yeah, unfortunately I placed that ninja monkey, so the, the new ninja monkey, on the wrong side. And therefore I lost quite a few lives. But still 70 lives, well 68 lives remaining. A third uh, farm in the way there. And yeah, now we're going to do something tricky. Yeah, well, not yet, but the boomerang monkey, uh, the, sorry, ninja monkeys first need to be upgraded. So uh, all four of them are upgraded. I can build one more, but I'm not going to uh, build that into a four and two because that would mean I would lose because there's no way this would take out the level 60 uh, BFB. There's just no way. So anyhow, uh, what we're doing here is we're going to build a zero and four uh, boomerang monkey. And, or sorry, ninja monkey. And the zero and four ninja monkey can actually uh, slow down that level 60 uh, balloon. And that would really, really help out. As you can see, I'm just gathering some, uh, some money here to get my first uh, four and two uh, boomerang monkey. And it is going to be one of the side ones because they have the best vision over the track. And that is just awesome. Here we go with the 0 and 4. So the 0 and 4 needs to be triggered three times in this, uh, in this playthrough. First of all, uh, before level 60, so before starting level 60. The, so you trigger it, you immediately launch level 60, uh, at least within 15 seconds. And it should all be fine. So uh, here we go. It is slow now and that means that we have an easy time taking it down. I'm now going to make it into two and four. So I, uh, I sold it to upgrade uh, a second boomerang monkey. And now it's already back up to uh, two and four. And we have the ability available to us again. But yeah, the uh, four and two boomerang monkeys are great at taking down mobs. They're not really great at, um, uh, well, at uh, mo in most tracks, but in this track they are amazing because of that little circle in the beginning. Uh, you normally need quite a few of them. So here is the second one before level 46. You want to trigger that uh, ability once again. And then here, yeah, I fast forward through all of this, but that is not something you should do. I uh, sell all of my banana farms here, by the way. But yeah, you shouldn't fast forward this. You should just, uh, yeah, wait until the Moabs come. And then once you see the first Moab, you want to hit that ability again. 
Fortunately, my monkeys were strong enough to take this out, but this was kind of close. Uh, you should, of course, have everything except for the first Moab slowed. And uh, because I fast forwarded, I only had the last BFB slowed. <laughs> so it was kind of messy. But anyway, it's, um, it's really not a problem. Um, this should be a really easy daily challenge, especially if you have that um, uh, dojo, so the boomerang dojo. Because then you, uh, yeah, you can upgrade three of the monkeys to the four and two, three of the boomerang monkeys. Otherwise, you can only get two, and you have a little more trouble, but it shouldn't be a problem at all. Um, yeah, hope you enjoyed, and I will see you next time. GG.
Thank you.